Hello everybody, today we are going to unbox a new Dell XPS. This one is 9315 XPS 13 2 in 1 Sky Color. It's a very nice, beautiful color. 13 inch i7 16 512 SSD. This is the box. This is the seal here. Recyclable renewable materials. Opens over here. We got another, I don't want to call it a box, but some kind of container. <laughs> oh, okay, laptop is here. And underneath the laptop, silica gel. It looks like, oh no, laptop is in this box. This feels like a cover. Mm, interesting. It's uh, almost, it's like dark blue. Oh, it's a keyboard. That's a keyboard. And here we have some uh, papers, XPS Folio, K20M. This is the keyboard, very nice material, very nice on touch. Buttons are very nice, easy to press. It's kind of very small space between them. 13 inch, so it's obviously no numeric keyboard. It's very nice like this, smooth. It's like super easy to press. I would say too easy, I don't know. Connects to the laptop here. This is super easy to open. And here we have the laptop. Let's take a look over here first. So we've got another menu. This one is for the laptop. XPS 2 in 1. We also get this adapter. USB-C to USB-A. Get the charger. It's similar to other XPS I reviewed. This kind of charger. This is the other part. Even the the cords uh, for the charger are made of very nice materials. I like it. So USB C uh, to headphone. If you want to use your headphones. I don't know, it's probably time to buy Bluetooth headphones, but okay. Mm, there's nothing else in there. And now we take a look at the laptop. Mm. So it feels like it's more of a tablet, right? Because we have keyboard separately. Look at this camera. I didn't find the serial number here. This huge camera, XPS over here, i7, it has i7 12th gen, it's super fast, super fast. There should be speakers. Here we connect the keyboard, we're gonna do it later. We have a Thunderbolt, USB-C, and here... I have a uh, focus. There should be volume buttons and turn on, turn off. It's a tablet. Look over here. So we'll take this and it connected very strong. Look 
close it like this. So it's kind of similar to Microsoft Surface Pro, something like that. Then you can do like this. It doesn't hold it well. Mm, yeah. Works like this. Tried the other way around, didn't work. So it needs to be like this, and then it's it's pretty sturdy. This looks so much different from um, this is Dell keyboard as well. The design is nice, but basil, I wish it was smaller. Look how big it is on both sides. Material is very nice, metal. Cover for the camera, it magnetizes. Yeah. This very nice material, eventually gonna get very dirty and ugly. Dell. If you buy it directly through Dell, you can spec it differently. It's 16, 1560. Um, you can spec it with i5 for less. Um, this i5 is pretty fast. Um, you probably don't need faster than that, but if you have the money, you can Spec for this home or pro uh, makes it a little bit cheaper, $60 difference. And uh, you can get 8 gig, which switches you to i5. Um, 8 gig is fine, but I would just go with 16. It's not that big of a price difference. It's a DDR4. Yeah, it's DDR4, unfortunately. I thought it would be 5. 512 or 1 terabyte. 14, 17, 1709. Um, so $150 difference for this, which probably cost them whatever, $20 difference. Um, 13 inch, it's 3K. Oh, it's uh, more three to, okay. So it's 2800 by 1920, touch screen obviously. Um, Gorilla 15 inch display, very good, very good, very good. Gorilla Glass Victus, uh, don't confuse with the uh, HP Victus. You have different uh, this, you can with stylus, without stylus, uh, folio stylus not included, would be cheaper. And 1359, okay, you can put this, put that, put this. And uh, that's pretty much it. You, can prob you probably want the folio, but I'm not sure if you want the stylus. Uh, 14 um, stylus only. Yeah, I'll, t I'll take like this. Uh, you can take everything, right? Everything for a bit of it. Yeah, it's fine. Just take everything. So if I were to spec it, uh, I would put uh, either one is fine. This one is more powerful, but this one is powerful enough, kind of. Um, whatever you prefer out of these, I would take 16 RAM. Um, 512 is fine, unless you need more. Uh, it's a tablet after all. Um, screen is great. Sky color is nice. It looks more blue on the pictures than in person. The tablet itself is more like... Uh, Let's take a look. Uh, the tablet itself is more like silver kind of. This thing is blue. It's more blue on the picture. Yeah. If you want a great tablet and you want to buy a Microsoft Surface, this is a great alternative. But it costs about just as much.